today we are going to prepare ayush kada powder here are the ingredients that we are going to use tulsi uh, which is basil leaves ginger cinnamon bark also known as dalchini black pepper okay so here we go we have the tulsi powder the cinnamon powder the ginger powder and the black pepper powder we are going to triturate them in the ratio of 4 is to 2 is to 2 is to 1 but we are going to do it in geometric progression so first of all we are going to add 1 teaspoon of black pepper powder followed by 2 teaspoons of cinnamon powder and then 2 teaspoons of dried ginger powder and finally we are going to triturate the mixture a little bit and add 4 teaspoons of tulsi powder and continue to mix it in clockwise direction as we are have to do it for 50 grams we are going to continue this process and we have fast forwarded uh, that bit for you the basil leaves and ginger root have been dried and powdered previously whereas the cinnamon bark and black pepper were grinded as they are already in dry state following this the preparation is almost ready we can prepare kadha by taking a spoonful of this powder and adding it to a glass of hot water or just store it in a dry container for future use in a clean and dry place this is the final trituration the ayush kada gives an expectorant effect after consumption and relieves the congestion in the upper respiratory tract if stored at a dry and hygienic place the powder can last up to 6 months to an year tulsi ginger cinnamon and black pepper all have expectorant properties by mixing them we get a combined effect and relief from the symptoms of cough and cold as it is easily prepared at home due to easy accessibility of the ingredients it can act as an easy to prepare home remedy now as the kadha powder is ready we are going to prepare kadha by adding it to a glass of hot water which is approximately 250 ml just a little bit of hot water and a teaspoon of the powder and the kadha is ready thank you